We're going to go over uh, a quick component on how to manage your native permissions. Uh, right now, we support microphone and camera. Uh, if you guys need more, let us know and we can add more. So if you want, just head over to Pragma Flow Servers, install component, go down to the native permission manager and install that. Uh, as always, Pragma Flow Inc, Adela Permissions Manager. And now let's just jump right in and see what this is for. So now that I've installed the permission manager, when I open my app, it will ask me if I want to allow uh, my app to take pictures and record video. So I'll say, while I'm using the app and microphone access while I'm using the app. We have that we've succeeded to get the microphone and we've granted access to the camera. So why would you wanna do this? So I know people have seen the jam space um, or jam systems and it works in the web, but not uh, natively. So this actually allows you to use it natively. So if I go from my phone and I go to jam systems, let me just start a room, one, two, three, four, five, ASS, join, start the room. So now if I take my phone and I start talking into my phone, we can see that I'm actually talking. Then it went away and now I started talking again and it comes back. We can turn the microphone off, oops, sorry. I rotated my phone. We can turn it back on and we can see us talking. Now let's just see if we take this here. And we go to the URL. And we join the room, we might hear a lot of feedback because I can hear, yep, there's the feedback. So we can see that the, the microphone's actually working on the system, but this isn't only limited to the microphone. So instead of jam systems, um, what if we what if we go to web? webcamtests.com. This is just a regular web view. Oh, it's detecting. Now I can say test my cam. And now I can see my webcam from my phone is actually streaming into the uh, web view. So that's it. That's really uh, all the, the component does is give you microphone and camera access. There's no other components with it. So it's really gonna be used with the web view. So if we head over and look, We have this permission manager. I'll just actually just go to the bottom here. Yeah, I probably removed it. Anyway, so we have the permission manager. When we drag and drop it, we can turn on the microphone and we can turn on the camera. If you don't need the microphone, you can turn it off. If you want it, you can turn it off. And then we have um, two actions per. So when somebody's granted permission to the microphone, this happens. And when it's not granted, this happens. So if this button requires the microphone, you can always change the visibility or disable it, or you can send a message, hey, you can't actually use this button unless you've actually granted permission to the camera and or the microphone. So the same actions over here, granted one camera, granted when not camera. And all I've done is just update these text boxes so we can see that it's granted or denied. And now this is just the standard web view. So I bound the URL to the standard web view. So if you wanna just put in your jam systems into the web view, uh, it, will, it will allow you to use the jam systems in the web view. So that's it.